Damn, you look like shit. Yeah, I just got back from the dentist. You know, if you just took care of your teeth, going to the dentist wouldn't be so bad. I take care of my teeth. Ah, please. Your teeth are so yellow, when you smile, it looks like you have gold grills. Fuck, man, that joke sucked. Hey, you suck. No, you suck. Well, you suck more. Well, I'm sorry I don't have the sucking experience you do. Maybe you can give me some pointers. Oh, God, will you two just quit it? I've had a long fucking day. I don't feel like dealing with this shit right now. <sighs> Jesus Christ. Okay. <sighs> Color correct. Green screen. Been up for fucking two days. Hello, this is Cute Fuzzy Weasel, and I just got done seeing the third and final presidential debate. This debate was a recap if there ever was one. I mean, seriously, this was the roundup. In my personal opinion, I don't think there needs to be any more commercials, debates, TV spots, talk about it. This was the end-all thing, or at least that's what it felt like to me. We heard the same old arguments from both guys, same lies from Romney, same awkward and missed opportunities from Obama, and honestly, I think we're ready. I mean, really, I, if it were up to me, I'd have the election tomorrow. I don't really think there's a need to wait anymore. And watch the moment I say something like that, something comes up in the news that upsets the whole race. Ah, but what, what can I say about the debate itself? Well, in a word, it was, uh, boring. Yeah, it was boring. I almost fell asleep to it. Now, the room was cold, and I was lying on the floor, and I was comfortable, but, you know... Seriously, I mean, I feel like I've heard the same thing that they both said over and over and over and over and over. I mean, it, it literally was like nothing new came up. And, you know, I don't think anything new is gonna come up. Except there was this one bit where Romney, uh, said something about Obama. I'm, I'm really... I'm, I'm kind of at a loss for what it was right now, but they said they were going to check the records during the debate. You know, I promised myself I was going to stay in there till they did, but I just... I don't know. I mean, I haven't... I honestly... I mean, I just haven't slept very much in the past week. The Halloween special's been taking up a lot of my time right now. That and my utter lack of social interaction. If I had to choose a winner for the debate, I'd say it's... Honestly, it's a toss-up. I mean, if you absolutely had to choose, I'd say the facts were more on Obama's side, so I guess Obama. I mean, seriously, after I'm done filming this thing, I'm gonna have to edit it and render it, and I'm not gonna sleep till four in the morning again. But enough about me, let's talk politics more. Actually, let's not. I've just done a recap of the whole debate. It was a recap of the whole election. And you know, I'm just gonna be so fucking happy when this whole thing is over, regardless of who gets elected. I mean, I'll be a little happier if Obama gets elected because then I'll be able to listen to Rush Radio again. You see, I stopped listening to Rush Radio because I, I just got so fucking sick of their lies. But if Obama wins, I'll gladly listen to them bitch about it. So anyway, there you have it. Video's gonna be short. Uh, part three of Conservative Elite will be coming sometime this week. I'd say around Thursday, maybe Wednesday. In fact, I'm gonna try and shoot for Wednesday because... I'm off on Wednesday. As for the Halloween special, I'm not sure if I want to upload it on Halloween or the day before Halloween because I come to realize that my audience is uh, global. And you know, the whole time zone issue. Speaking of time zones, how's it going, South Africa? Someone from South Africa sent me a message, so I'm, I'm, I'm saying hi back to them. Hi, South Africa. How's it going? Anyway, have a good day, and I will see you uh, uh, probably Thursday.